Why the fuck do they release this so early in the morning? My fucking god, oh god I'm sleeping. God damn it, I'm not waiting that early in the morning every day to see if there's a Gotham Knights video or not. Fuck me, man. But it is behind the scenes video about creating Harley for the game, so let's get into it. Before I talk with you idiots, make sure to comment down below if you like this Harley Quinn video or not. Like the video if you enjoy and subscribe for more Gotham Knights content. And if you don't subscribe, then I'm gonna break up with your mom. Okay, pause. I need to show you guys this photo. Look at this. Look at this photo I just saw on Instagram. Holy fucking shit. Guys, I'm fucking spinning right now. <laughs> guys, look at this. What the hell? What, guys? I'm losing. Okay, we'll get to the video right now. But, God, holy shit, this is a fucking amazing photo that just got released for Gotham Knights. Holy shit. Even though it's a seven minute video, it doesn't feel like that we learned that much for Harley. One new thing that we learned is that this is supposedly an older Harley Quinn for the game. Harley Quinn is already a very well developed character within Gotham City. The Gotham Knights are already very familiar with her as she has been encountered by the Gotham Knights several times over the last several years. She's already explored her arc of her being Joker's girlfriend wearing the Jester outfit and all that and she's already explored her arc of her being a part of the Suicide Squad being Amanda Waller's bitch basically. And now she's back in Gotham City being an evil villain again. The developers also said that she's a villain and not an anti-hero because they think that Harley's been acting like an anti-hero so much over the last several years in any DC media that they decided to have her go back to her being a villain again for the game. I mean they're not wrong, Harley's pretty much considered an anti-hero nowadays so it's cool to see her going back to being a straight up villain here. And there is the part of the video where they go over all the concept designs that they had for Harley for the game and they ended up going for this one which I'm actually kind of liking now the upside down heart and all that it, it's, it's new and all that yeah I know it's new and I, I'm liking it honestly the outfits look uh, the outfit honestly looks pretty cool in my opinion and the heart like I said I'm getting used to it so just yeah I'm just, I'm just liking the outfit and all these other uh, concept designs they had they look pretty cool I guess I don't know how, like how to rate them just like it's just the best one the mal just, just look look at this guys just look at this it looks pretty good in my opinion I'm starting to like it a lot now this video also came out of nowhere from my gen they finished talking about gotham knights like two weeks ago with their hands-on preview or what just their preview video and they that was pretty much it for all of august with all the videos they showed off and now we get this one like two weeks later and it, it just came out of nowhere that's why i got mad because i'm sleeping i wake up and oh what the fuck three hours ago there's a video for gotham knights what the hell Guys, yeah, I don't know what to say. It's just, it's so good that IGN is giving us this much coverage for Gotham Knights. It's amazing. They're they're saving the game. They're literally saving us and the game by showing us all these videos talking about the game. And I cannot thank them enough for showing us all of this stuff. We need to see this type of video for the Court of Owls. We need to see this for Mr. Freeze. We need to see this for Penguin. And we need to see this for Clayface, guys. But like I said, even though this is a seven minute video talking about Harley Quinn for the game, I honestly do not know what else to say about her. Everything I said is pretty much the only only key notes that I took off from this video. So we got this video and apparently tomorrow Gotham Knights will be showed off at the Tokyo Game Show and I'll probably be live streaming that tomorrow so stay tuned for that. Comment down below what you're expecting to hear at the Tokyo Game Show tomorrow for Gotham Knights. Like the video if you enjoyed and subscribe for more Gotham Knights content. See you next time you beautiful bitches.